Hey there folks, hope you're having a good day. And today's video by request was, how do I sharpen charcoal for drawing? So I'm just gonna show you uh, uh, a one piece of charcoal I'm gonna take and I'm gonna sharpen it. And um, this is something that I learned in school. It's kind of a discipline. It's something that kind of like the other video, you know, you get everything set up and you make sure you have everything ready before you're gonna draw and getting your charcoal sharp is definitely one of the most important things. So, I can show you guys, uh, I'm gonna show you a drawing that I did uh, years ago when I first started studying um, at the Atelier. And I'll show you right here. This, let's see it there. This was a bar drawing that I did a long time ago, right? Um, it turned out pretty good. It turned out pretty good. And uh, one of the most important things when you're doing a drawing like that, when you when you're into uh, in classical training, um, is you have to learn how to sharpen your tools. So I'm going to show you guys real quick here. Uh, I have charcoal. All right. Now, for those of you who don't know. I'm an instructor at the Southern Atelier School of Fine Arts in Sarasota, Florida, and I've been studying with Charles Miano for many years, and I now teach online classes, and I work with all the apprentices in the studio. So um, that's a little bit of my background, and, uh, and I'm making these videos to, um, to basically give out tips and stuff, and if you guys like the videos, then you know you can go and you can check out uh, some of the other classes that um, we actually have a lot of classes online that are available and the ones that I'm teaching are going to be more uh, drawing classes so you, you're more than welcome to check them out all right so let me get to where you guys can see this okay so stick of charcoal right you can see it it's like a it's a block I think you can see it there Here's what I do. This right here, this is a little sanding block, okay? I just take this, sandpaper, a little garbage can over here. This charcoal can be very, very messy, so you need to be careful with it. You need to have a garbage can close by, and um, if you can, you know, you don't want to be breathing in tons of charcoal dust, so keep that in mind, okay? All right, here we go. Hopefully you can see this. So I go from having the block here. Oops, let me get it up where you can see it. Like that. And that's gonna knock it off because it's gonna build up quick. You can save that charcoal dust if you want. I usually don't. But um Had a request for this video a few days back, and I've been really busy. I haven't been able to do it. But if you guys have videos or questions, anything you want me to demonstrate, feel free to post your comments down below. So, when you're in an atelier or you're in the school, and you're getting classically trained, one thing that you're gonna learn is patience. <laughs> That's for sure. And just sharpening the tools is huge. Now, there's a lot of things going on here that I'm doing. I'm rotating the charcoal and being very, very careful with how much pressure I put on it. You have to control that. That's looking pretty good. That's looking pretty decent right there. You guys can see that. That's pretty sharp. I could probably make it a little bit sharper. That's good. Okay. Alright, get this out of the way here. Now. Boop doo doo. Okay. So there you go. Hopefully you guys can see it. Sometimes it's I look at the wrong angle of this camera on here. Well, you can see that. All right, that's what you want right there. Razor sharp, okay? And that's it. 
And that's how you show up in the charcoal. I can show you the drawing again. Uh, I'm not getting into like all this. Stuff. I just wanted to show you guys. So that's how you're you're able to get you know all these you know transitions and get all these nice clean lines and things like this is because the charcoal is sharp. So if you guys like these videos, if you want me to make uh, any, any other uh, questions that you have, like I said, post your comments, questions down below. Subscribe to the channel if you want to. And um, there should be an Instagram, Facebook um, link on the homepage there for the YouTube. And I will keep making the videos. Stay tuned because the next video I will be doing a drawing demo. And I'm going to be designing, uh, designing a tattoo on this one. So it should be pretty cool. I got a neat little idea. And uh, before the video, I'm going to break it down and, and show you guys the connections from classical training that I connect with. Um, that type of art with tattoo drawing so stay tuned for that and check it out and I hope you guys have a good night like I said hit the thumbs up if you like the video and let me know something the other video that you would like uh, like me to make all right take care and I'll see you guys on the next video bye